Let's check in now with Chief Meteorologist Ashley Gann for a look at what we can expect today yeah, or tonight. Just hot. A little different than yesterday. Not as many storms popping up on the radar, but we are seeing a little haze in the sky. Mm -hmm. This is a live look from our Talladega Super Speedway camera. Lots of sunshine. See some fair weather cumulus clouds, but you might have seen a bit of the haze across central Alabama today, and that's because of wildfire smoke from a big wildfire happening well to our north and to our east, but it's created some bands of more visible smoke across our viewing area and here's our smoke forecast. So again, fire really concentrated to our northeast, but these yellow bands mean that there could be an increased haze in the sky, but you'll notice our winds will start moving out of the north and that kind of pushes this smoke along to the south. So we could actually see this kind of hazy sky expanding through early tomorrow morning. I think it's most noticeable earlier in the day. That's when our air temperatures are a little lower dew points are up. So you kind of get this inversion layer so you can kind of see it a little closer to Earth's surface during the day when the hot air expands that smoke is able to be at the higher levels of the atmosphere not as visible to the eye right now it's hot though temperatures in the mid to upper 80s low 90s Birmingham's at 90 Moundville's at 90 so if you're out on the town tonight try to stay cool it's expected to stay close to 90 degrees even through the six o'clock hour we'll be at 83 degrees at eight o'clock tonight but here's that Thursday setup for us scattered showers and storms will be returned as this upper level system tracks to the south, that will bring storms to the deep south. Some of the stronger storms, though, I think south of I-20 in the peach state of Georgia. But for us, heavy rainfall at times, and it is going to feel a little bit more muggy tomorrow. You'll notice I'm going to highlight really two opportunities for heaviest rainfall. One of those is tomorrow, and another will be late Sunday into Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday of next week, kind of just your general summertime thunderstorms. But here's a look at those system. So for tonight, things will be dry and quiet, but by tomorrow that cold front moves in and you'll see this line developing along that line. We will see a broken band of thunderstorms from Fayette, Tuscaloosa, Alabaster to Alex City, but it will race south pretty quickly. These are not going to be storms that linger too long. Don't expect any severe weather, but notice the quickly clearing sky behind that. Friday it's dry and less humid, but then as we move into Sunday, another system moves in. Heavy rainfall. Some of these storms could be quite strong late Sunday night into early Monday in the production of some hail, heavy rain, and frequent lightning. That's going to be the biggest concern, so we'll keep an eye on things Sunday night into Monday. Drier air though, Tuesday and Wednesday, although I will still maintain a small chance of rain. Temperatures next week staying in the 80s and low 90s. And that's a look at your storm team seven day forecast. Ashley, thank you.